Okay, greetings everybody. It's Michael McGregor with the Sensible Living Podcast here with a quick little overview of the Baofeng Radio. We're going to turn this one on real quick. All right, as you can see, uh, we are actually set into... There's frequency mode. So I'm going to turn this over to basically point of um, line of sight, basically line of sight. And we're going to switch the frequency mode over to, let's see, four, six, two. I'm going to set it to there. And then I'm going to go into menu. Menu 13. I'm going to go to my CTS. As you can see there. I'm going to scroll down. Uh, our CTS is off. Our docs. And I'm going to scroll through because I want to make sure my transmit and receive CTS is off. My step can... I usually leave my step at uh, 2.5K and do not want to reset all. I want to make sure I go to... There's band, that's uh, VHF. Delete channel, memory channel. My offset. want to make sure at this point, I'm going to hit menu when I'm there. Okay, want to have the offset set basically to nothing, 000.000. 000. My shift is going to be off. So I have no offset and no CTS. Now with that, I can exit. This is now set to line of sight or an FRS. Now with that, I can go in. I want, I'm not going to do it now because I don't want to reset all my channels, I can go through and add this to one of my memory channels. And the FRS channels are 462 462.562, 462.587, 462.612, 462.637, and 462.662. That is your family radio service, FRS. These little bow fangs will go on them. You're only you're limited to uh, uh, two meter and five meter on them. These bow fangs sometimes can hit eight. So the FCC does get a little pissy. Um, also, as you can see, I actually have an 18 inch antenna added to my bow fangs just to give me a little bit more reception here, um, which works fine. This is actually. I can fold it down, make it a little bit easier. Um, funny thing is, if you take these little things apart, they're actually old um, measuring tapes. So they're not anything special. It's basically measuring tape, so you can fold it. But that is how simple it is to go through and program your Baofeng. So menu... 1-3 will take you to your TCTS, and you can scroll up and down. And then, let's see, we can, and then if you hit, like, memory 22, I believe it is. I believe memory 22 or 26. Memory 28, 27 is your memories. Memory, uh, menu 26 is offset, menu 25. So if you just want to get somewhere fast, menu. Just hit menu and then 25 and you're there. Frequency direction. And that'll change your direction, offset there. Menu. So that's your Baofeng and just setting it up that way. And then you're gonna learn eventually, uh, once you have your ham radio license, you'll learn how to go in and actually set your, basically your repeaters. I'm not gonna do a repeater tonight, I just wanted to do a quick little FRS, and that's what you got for that. And I'm gonna go back. Channel mode. Whoa, that's a little loud. Go back to my channel mode. This is, uh, like I said, this 145.310 here in Cheyenne is actually a repeater here. And there we go. I have my little, um, my little Baofeng setup. It works pretty well. 
and that's how you set it up so there's a quick little video for everybody I will get to uh, setting up for um, repeaters um, in a couple days I'm going to do the two main Denver repeaters um, 145.145 and 145.310 um, which is the Colorado Connection, and we will go from there. All right, so everyone remember, as I always say, watch your six. This is Michael McGregor out, and y'all have a wonderful day.